After two years of COVID-19 pandemic restrictions, diseases, and shifting borders, unfortunately, we have another public health disaster, monkeypox. Monkeypox is an uncommon illness that is related to smallpox. Currently, there are no vaccines for monkeypox, but a smallpox vaccine gives 85% protection against the new virus. Monkeypox has no particular therapy and typically resolves on its own and pain, fever, and irritation from the rash can be relieved with medications. Hi, this is Max from the Visa Library. In this video, I will talk about monkeypox and its possible effects on traveling, what travelers should do to avoid it, and other stuff. Subscribing to our channel gives us energy and support, so do it. Monkeypox symptoms can appear from 5 to 21 days after your exposure and include fever, chills, lymph node enlargement, headache, muscular ache, joint discomfort, backache, exhaustion, and the emergence of a rash. Monkeypox virus spreads in three ways. From one person to the next, by getting into direct touch with contaminated objects, and from animals to people. Contact with an infected person can be a cause of monkeypox transfer from one person to another. The contact can be in the form of a skin, body fluids or blood, sharing clothing, razors, needles, and other items, the droplets from coughing and sneezing, and sexual contact. One thing, some experts believe that the pregnant women might pass the virus to their babies. To this date, most of the patients were infected through intimate sexual intercourse. One question, will monkeypox cause travel disruptions? Activities such as music festivals, pride celebrations, and spontaneous tourist gatherings may be the places for catching monkeypox, but many doctors believe that such activities should not be canceled. Instead, organizers should utilize them to increase illness awareness. Many health professionals believe that venue shutdowns or event cancellations do not diminish sexual contact. At this point, although there are some concerns regarding catching monkeypox while traveling, it is unlikely to have any widespread flight cancellations or border closures. The WHO suggests isolating yourself until symptoms have entirely resolved. Now, how easy it is to catch monkeypox while traveling? Given the intimate skin-to-skin -skin contact required for monkeypox transmission, many doctors believe that the general public do not need to be concerned about contracting the virus unless they plan to participate in high-risk activities. Another question, what can travelers do to avoid monkeypox? Travelers can protect themselves against illness by preventing close contact with infected people and goods, avoiding kisses, cuddles, or touching other people, not sharing any eating containers or mugs, not touching a sick person's mattress or clothing, and avoiding intimate touch, especially sexual contact with a person who is sick and may have monkeypox. In terms of personal hygiene, you must wash your hands with soap and water regularly. In the absence of soap and water, you can use alcohol-based hand sanitizers with at least 60% of alcohol. Keep your hands away from your face, particularly your eyes and your nose and your mouth. Ensure your hands are clean before touching your face. And if you work with animals or care for them, Use protective clothing, including gloves. Another tip for avoiding monkeypox while traveling is avoiding animals. Don't touch live or dead wild animals. Don't touch or consume wild animal products. Touching animal used stuff such as bedding should be completely avoided. And 
avoid interactions with monkeys, rats, mice, and squirrels, and avoid consuming raw meat from these animals. The risk to the general population is low, but if you get a new unusual skin rash, whether you have fever or chills, see a doctor immediately and avoid touching others. Make an appointment if possible before visiting a healthcare establishment. If you cannot call ahead, inform a staff member of your worry about monkeypox when you arrive there. Inform your doctor if, in the month preceding the onset of symptoms, you had contact with someone who could have had monkeypox or been in a region where monkeypox has been recorded more frequently. If you suspect you have monkeypox, avoid taking public transportation until you have been cleared by a healthcare expert or public health officials. Another question, should travelers be worried about monkeypox? The CDC has issued a level two travel health notification encouraging passengers to exercise extra measures such as washing and cleaning their hands frequently and avoiding touching their faces. Although a type of monkeypox vaccine exists, it is not required to get vaccinated in order to go abroad. Vaccines are in short supply and tourists should be mindful of places with high illness rates and try avoiding them. However, many governments stated that the sickness poses little risk to the general population. They also stated the average tourist or business visitor need not be worried about monkeypox while traveling. In addition, it is stated that the prolonged close physical contact, like, like that between family members in the same housing or via sex intercourse, is a concern, but that there is a very minimal chance of transmission through casual contact. Some countries like the UK, Belgium, and Germany have all set 21-day quarantine rules for those who have been diagnosed with monkeypox. However, for the time being, monkeypox shouldn't be a concern while traveling. Most visitors should not be concerned unless they engage in increased risk behavior when they are in regions that have high infection rates. But that's it. If you stick to the safety recommendations I gave you, you should be all right. If you like our content, consider subscribing to our channel and supporting us. I wish all of you safe travels free of any problems and indices. Thank you all for watching.